Yo, 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 what's up? What's up? It's your boy. It's your boy, Op C, up in the joint. What's going on? What's going on? All right, we peeling this thing out. We peeling out. We peeling out. That's what we doing. The day is... Not go for no Fridays, man. The day Thursday. So it's the one thing Thursday. This is... It's not, it's not the one thing Thursday. This is... Come on. This is... The full agreements Thursday. And I got it posted right over my kitchen sink. And I read through it being impeccable with my word. Don't take things personally. Don't make assumptions and always do your best. But I'll tell you to always do your best. That's powerful stuff right there, baby. That's powerful stuff. It's almost like my like I need to get back into my cubby, you know, sharpening the saw. What are you doing? Sawing. How long you been doing it? Man, hours. That's what the guy said. All day. Hey, why don't you um, sharpen the saw? Hey, man, I'm too busy sawing. They got time to sharpen those saw. When I'm sawing, can't you see I'm sawing? Dumb, dumb. See, that's the deal, baby. We got to take time to sharpen that saw. This four agreements is sharpening the saw. It's going back day after day, week after week, touching each one of them blades. Bow, bow. Honing it a little bit more, a little bit more, getting it to a razor sharp. Man, instead of razor sharp, we're going to go laser sharp. You want that thing laser sharp? My son was watching one of these... Uh, these guys that uh, I think it was some guys versus Superman and one of the guys, Superman got stabbed. He was like, man, how I get stabbed? Because Superman supposedly had some real dense atoms or something in his body, whatever. But this guy had a blade so sharp that it could slice through individual, it could separate individual atoms or something like that. That's how he's able, able to cut Superman. But tell me, that's why I'm trying to get this sharp, this saw that I got sharp. Let me tell you, that's how I know it ain't sharp, because check this out, right? I told you, my daughter been looking for a house, right? And they looking at a fixer upper. And I really hadn't been out to look at the house. I hadn't looked at it. It was actually about, you know, how much the flooring costs. Should we do this? What about the drywall? What about the painting? I never, I hadn't been into it. Hadn't been into it. And I've been talking about all these resources I got, but I had a, a mind blank. I, man, who to call? You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of contacts, but who to call, right? On something like that, right? Right? So I had to dig in. I finally made one phone call, but I got to make another one to my, to my flooring guy, right? Because I just want to get some, get a, get, a, get an input. And then I just dawned on me, man. I said, why have you been, this is, a, this is a big thing for your daughter. This is the big thing. You hadn't been out there gouging through it with them. You know what I'm saying? You hadn't been gouging through it with them with your expertise over the years. And why is that? Because of the guilt. Yeah, you heard it. You heard it. Because of the guilt, man. That, that, or the four agreements, the symbiote, the, the parasite, the judge and the, and the jury was attacking the victim. Say, ah, man, ain't no use you going out there. Let them do what they gonna do, man. Cause you don't know what you're really doing cause you ain't really finished what you started anyway. How can you tell them, man, that you ain't even did it on this level, huh? How can you do that? So I've been shying away out of the guilt, man. It's crazy. It's crazy. I see, man, it's crazy, man. I'm taking off tomorrow to go out there, get in with this thing, man. It's hands-on type stuff, you know? Let's just get in with it. Because, you know, it's to a certain point, right? Because I'm thinking, I know how to do it to a certain level. But if you're talking about flipping or something like that, maybe it need to be done at a higher level. I mean, I don't know this is your first house, how you want it, you know? I don't, because I, I was thinking to myself, I don't want you to get in there and then you got projects and you ain't, that ain't been done. But this may be the catalyst. I don't know, right? So this is what I'm saying. I got a shop in the saw. I still got work to do. This, this, you know, I'm not really, I wasn't, 
I'm not naive and think that I'm going to do it in two or three years, right? But I'm noticing these nuances. These are, these are little small nuances. I didn't take the cue. You know, that was a different level that it came in. And why am I dragging my feet? See, that's always the cue of some fear. And then I'm supposed to dive into it. But I didn't, you know, I let my wife and my, and my daughter down. Cause my daughter kind of headstrong. She kind of got her certain kind of people that she's connected with. And I think I may have taken offense to some of that. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, I kind of put some ideas out there. She said, nah, look, I'm gonna go with so-and-so and so. So I kind of probably took some offense in that capacity. You know what I'm saying? Cause you can't, I say, you know, you really, can't go wrong, right? All it, go, all it is is money. You pay a little bit too much. Could have got it for $10,000 less versus you pay the extra $10,000. In the grand scheme of things, I think that's kind of how it's, it's boiling out to. And when you're talking about $300,000, $10,000, to me, it's not a big idea. I'm at another point in my life as well too that I know there's going to be some fudge around the numbers. But as long as you're within the range, you need to move on. You need to proceed because otherwise you could get paralysis by analysis. Because I've had some people, you know, my, in my line of industry of uh, selling products and services, people be like, yeah, but I could get save this right here. I said, look, this opportunity won't last. Oh, yeah, I mean, well, if it don't last, no problem. Then when this opportunity go, they back. Like, hey, what happened? What happened to the opportunity? Gone. I seen people go six, seven, eight years, maybe months or years, because they missed that one and they've been immobilized. That if I didn't get down, I ain't gonna get that. Same thing with the stocks, right? Me and my wife, we was on the stock last night. We was on the stocks. You jump in the stock, you lose some money. Ah, man, it's, forget this stock. I ain't getting back in that stock. But you're supposed to have another strategy because it is still a good stock. Go and get back in it and then make up, hey, make up for it. You see what I'm saying? If it's on a sound strategy, they say don't get into revenge trade. <laughs> hey, that revenge, revengeance, vengeance is left to the Lord. Vengeance is left to the Lord. So don't get into that revenge trade. Don't do it. Don't get into revenge on anything, man. Because you got to do your best. You got to do your best in love, man. And it'll put you back in the groove, man. And the thing that you think you lost, man, guess what? You came up. Two time, three time, four time, some 30, some 60, some 100 fold. You see what I'm saying? Some 30, some 60, some 100 fold. We don't let the cares of this world choke the word out. I said, uh, Mark chapter four. Yeah. So, I'm learning, they're they getting me to go in. I'm, I'm getting some stuff. Get some stuff down, man. The security coming because they, hey, look, why don't you uh, talk to this person, man? I, I'm, I'm a, in the past, nobody wanted to talk to this person because they knew this person was going to be mad. So yesterday, I said, you know what? I talked to the person. I was kidding them like I wasn't going to talk to them, but I said, you know, I call the person, man. Ain't no big deal. You know, I still feel a little bit in there, but this is my go for no. I got to do it, right? I got to strengthen that muscle. So ain't nobody gonna get hurt. They can, they can call you, but if I'm going in the spirit of love and knowing that I did my best, then I can call them. Knowing that I did my best, I can come. But if I didn't do my best, oh man, the judge, the judge gonna get me. The guilt gonna get me. Then I'll be going in trying to cover my butt, see? That's the wrong motive. That's the wrong motive, but as long as, I'm, as long as I'm in love and I did my best, the phone call is the phone call. It's just what it is. And then if you get the deal, fine. You don't get the deal, that's fine too. Because that's the way, that's the way it uh, mapped out, see? 
So that's the name of the game. That's the name of the game. So I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna pop in this um this to the four agreements on the way to work. Sharpen this saw a little bit more. Talk to another part of me. You know, man, in it you can't you can't you can't trust that man. In them later later hours of the day when I'm getting ready to go to bed, I can't make no major decisions. Cause this is stuff I said later yesterday. Now with this fresh mind this morning, I'm thinking, man, yeah, you ain't have to do that. This guy, this guy was telling me that he said, hey, my my one thing plan, man, I figured if I can get a hundred thousand in cash in the bank, that's gonna set me up. I'll be able to do whatever I want to do. I said that's gonna me logically saying that with a hundred grand, you can't do whatever you want to do. By the way, what would you do? That's a question, right? Give me to think a little bit. And, and, and what you gonna do in the meantime? Do you put everything on hold till then? Because this part of me has been putting stuff on hold for a future happiness. Well, we should be happy and celebrate right now. See what I'm saying? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm looking at. So, I'm gonna go and uh, sit down with them. I still hadn't apologized to my wife yet. I'm waiting for that to kind of trickle in to see how that's gonna play out. Waiting for all lights on green, the opportune time. But I did mention too about managing the job too. It takes away well from, from our time. I'm gonna mention that again. It's a slippery slope in the acquisition of things for happiness. You know what I'm saying? All right. We finna, we finna peace out. We finna do it to life. We finna peace out. We finna do it to life. We finna peace out. We finna do it to life. We finna peace out. We finna do it to life. Oh, there we go.